This video is for educational purposes only. Do not use any tools and techniques shown here for illegal or unauthorized activities. The creator is not responsible for any misuse of the information provided. First up, Funter, a digital bloodhound for phone numbers. It queries public APIs to find details like your mobile operator, line type, and sometimes your region. Attackers use this info to craft phishing scams or target numbers for smishing. Security teams use Funner to see what outsiders can learn about their organization's numbers. It helps simulate attacks and find weaknesses before real threats do. Don't underestimate what a phone number can reveal. Ignorant is a tool for checking if a phone number is real and properly formatted. It can pull basic metadata, like country code, to hint at a number's origin. Use dummy data to test if apps validate numbers correctly or leak information. Validating numbers helps clean data and spot leaks early. Even basic OSINT tools are vital for security. Now, let's talk APIs. Specifically, NumVerify. It's a professional-grade service for phone number validation and intelligence. NumVerify automates checks for thousands of numbers, returning carrier, line type, and registration location. This data helps build detailed profiles. Knowing if a number is VoIP, mobile, or landline can change an attacker's approach. For defenders, NumVerify enriches logs, revealing patterns in access attempts, like spikes from certain countries or carriers. Red teams use it to batch validate numbers. Blue teams use it to spot threats. It's all about context. NumVerify delivers it fast. The more you know about a number, the better you can defend against attacks. Intelligence is power. Use it wisely. Now let's connect numbers to names with OpenCNAM. This service queries caller ID databases, revealing the name linked to a phone number. For attackers, a name turns anonymous digits into a real identity, fuel for targeted social engineering. Ethical hackers use OpenCNAM to show how easy it is to personalize phishing attempts. Defenders can use this to educate employees, your name might be publicly linked to your number. It's a reminder to minimize what you share. Do you really need your full name and direct line on your website? OpenCNAM makes the risks of caller ID spoofing and data exposure tangible. It's a bridge from number to identity, one that's easy to cross. Rethink what you make public. Every detail is a potential vulnerability. Awareness is your first line of defense. Let's get more precise with TellEyes, a geolocation API. TellEyes estimates a phone number's likely city or region, not exact GPS, by analyzing prefixes and carrier data. Red teams use it to build movement patterns, work by day, home by night, without ever touching GPS. For security awareness, it's a powerful demo. Attackers can profile your location just from your number. Defenders integrate TellEyes into threat intelligence, adding geographic context to suspicious activity. A login attempt from a local IP? Maybe harmless. A thousand from a cybercrime hotspot? Major red flag. Talese helps prioritize threats and spot policy violations, like app use outside allowed regions. It's not magic, but it's close. Location data, even approximate, is a valuable clue. The takeaway, your number can reveal where you are, and that's a risk. Stay aware of how location leaks happen. Every data point adds up. Not all OSINT tools are complex. Some are as simple as a Telegram chat. Meet BMINP bot, send it a number, get the mobile operator back instantly. Attackers love the speed, no scripts, just a quick check on their phone. In training, it's a hands-on way to show how easy it is to gather info for targeted scams. Knowing the carrier lets attackers craft believable smishing texts. T-Mobile alert, your bill is overdue. The barrier to entry is low, anyone with Telegram can use this. Defenders must realize, threats aren't just from pros, but from opportunists with easy tools. The landscape is wide open, multi-layered defenses are a must. OSINT is democratized, vigilance is everyone's job. Don't underestimate simple tools, they're powerful in the wrong hands. MNP Bot, another Telegram tool, specializes in mobile number portability. It reveals not just the current carrier, but also the number's region and portability history. Why does this matter? Ported numbers can be exploited in port-out scams. Attackers hijack your number to intercept 2FA codes. Red teams use MNP Bot to map workforce regions and demonstrate real-world risks. It's a practical way to show how attackers identify which carrier to target for a port-out attack. For defenders, it's a reminder, your phone number's history is a vulnerability. Training with MNP Bot connects the dots from OSINT to real attacks. Protect your accounts, 
your number is a critical security link. Portability is convenient, but it comes with risks. LeakCheck Bot scans your number against massive data breach databases. Instantly, attackers can see if your number was exposed in breaches, fuel for credential stuffing, and targeted attacks. Security teams use it to audit organizational exposure, finding patterns in where numbers have leaked. The results justify stronger policies, don't use corporate numbers for personal accounts, and always use unique passwords. For individuals, it's a wake-up call. Breaches don't just disappear, your data is searchable forever. Enable two-factor authentication and use strong, unique passwords everywhere. Leak Checkbot shows how one breach can cascade across your digital life. Awareness is key. Don't let your number be the weak link. Once leaked, your data is out there for good. Sometimes you need local expertise. Enter InMob Prefix. This open source tool maps Indian phone prefixes to states and carriers, offering regional granularity global tools miss. Attackers use it to craft region-specific phishing or to analyze workforce distribution. Defenders can model threats unique to their local context, tailoring security strategies accordingly. Combining global and local tools gives a sharper picture of risk. Privacy isn't one-size-fits-all. Local data matters. InMob Prefix is a reminder. Think globally. Act locally in security. Regional details can make or break your defenses. Urbis takes reverse phone lookups to the next level, connecting numbers to social media profiles. It aggregates public data, linking your number to Facebook, Instagram, and more. For red teams, it's a jackpot. One number can unlock a target's entire online life. The ethical use is limited, only in controlled, authorized tests. For everyone else, it's a lesson. Using your main number for signups exposes you to major privacy risks. Consider a secondary number for online accounts and review your privacy settings. Urbis proves a phone number is a skeleton key to your digital identity. Protect it like you would your password. Convenience comes at a cost. Guard your number. Step 1. Update your privacy settings on all devices and apps. Step 2. Use strong, unique passwords and enable two-factor authentication. Step 3. Keep your software and security tools up to date. Step 4. Know the laws. Never use OSINT tools unethically. Like and subscribe for more practical security tips.